Hi, let's continue with our story. This uh, video is a replacement for one of the videos on this uh, page here. We're installing with UEFI and there is some change and that's why we're going to make a new video about it. So we followed the tutorial. We have, uh, as you can see on the screen, we've already formatted everything. CF disk is out of the way and swap is on and everything else, but we haven't mounted anything. So I'm gonna follow what's on the website. It says mount SDA3 inside the folder mount. Then make a directory inside mount boot. So actually the directory boot has been created inside mount, mount existed. But we're going to do one more and that is different than in older videos. So that's a better approach for VirtualBox and later on also for the real metal installation. When we do this, we can actually say mount me then also the device to boot from SDA1. So the EFI is going to be mounted in here. And that's it. So that's basically what this is all about. So this part of the video and number 11 is going to get uh, deleted and I'll make a new one. All right, 